Hello everybody, uh, welcome to, or if this is your first time watching, this is part 10 of Pokemon Shining for Holy crap, it's been a long time. <laughs> it's been like a week or two since I've recorded Pokemon Shining Pro. But um, yeah, I've been busy. Uh, IRL shit, I guess. And then I've been playing some Mario Party with my friends. <laughs> um, recently I bought uh, this Pokemon Plus Plus, which is like an oval shape Pokeball. It's pretty cool. It catches some Pokemon automatically. And Pokemon Go, and then there's a sleep process thingy that apparently uh, you don't need Pokemon to sleep, you could just fucking, um, what's it called? Use it in Pokemon Go, the sleep function as well. But I haven't tried that out yet because <laughs> I'm a gamer, I barely get enough sleep. <laughs> yeah, I'm too busy gaming, I guess. That sounds really gay. <laughs> Opinion appears to be very happy. That was great, I'm glad you're happy. It's been such a long time. Vespa Queen, Torterra, Hapini, Mistravis, Krogunk, and Luxray. Um, where are we? We're in Orgo, obviously, but what's next? Uh, defeat the Gym Leader at the Pastoria Gym. Oh! Water Guy. Why are we here? Um. I know I have fly, but there must be a good reason why I was here. Is it to get the gibble? Do I have strength? I do, but I don't have the requirement. Yeah, let's see. I need to get to uh, beat him. Yeah, so... I guess um, my mindset was to get the gibble, but I can't get the gibble because the gibble is, um... Trapped in a boulder. I don't even know why I went to the fucking Pokemart. Okay. Whatever. Just heal. Oh, um. No, I'll do it after. But my. What I was gonna say is that I should give Baby Hippini. Um. I'll take Baby Hapini to the city so the lady can massage her. So Baby Hapini can be more friendly and probably evolve into Chansey. Nice. Alright, let's keep on going. Pokemon, what do you guys say? The Great Marsh keeps the weather cool in the summertime. This is a good town for water type Pokemon. Oh, okay. I study rare Pokemon that marsh. Uh, fuck. I study rare Pokemon that appear only in the Great Marsh. Okay, great. There's a hidden item somewhere. Yep, okay. Right here. Full heal. Nice. Uh, the rain area. I've been hiking all around the Sinnoh region. I love planting berries wherever I go. I'll give you a berry too. Please plant it somewhere. A uh, Chilan berry. What the fuck? Subliminal messaging? It's the three cheers for Puffin Corner. How do you do? Oh, that's not what I wanted when it's in Galactic. We bring you the Puffin Maniac as our returning guest. How do you do? Today we have a fresh Puffin, not leftover by Brian. Oh, spicy dry puffin, yeah. Eating this would be like having a puffin contest show in my mouth. Upon seeing this finish uh, upon seeing the finished puffin, Brian had to say, had this to say. I created this while imagining a super contest show. Very impressive, Puffin Mania. You know what you're talking about. Oh, I dearly love to eat one of those. Viewers take a cue from Brian and get cooking. Back next time with more mouth watering puffins. Okay, people are stalking me. <laughs> My sister gathers berries every day. Please come visit again. We cook the berries too. We mix them up. They're yummy. Okay, so this lady is a good berry person. So it's this lady and the berry master. Gives free berries every day. So that's not bad. You know about Burmy and how they come in different 
farms? Do you have all farms of that there, Burmy? Aw, oh, you don't even have a single Burmy. You don't like them? They're kind of mushy and cute. Hmm, Burmy are an interesting example. They hint at how the environment can shape people's personalities. That's true. I'm just exploring. I forgot what's in this town. What do you got? Everyone calls me the Pokemon Move Maniac. I prefer Move Tutor. I know every move that Pokemon learn while they're leveling up, and I can teach Pokemon those moves. I could teach a move to a Pokemon of yours if you'd like. I'll do it if you trade me a heart scale. Oh, that's it. That's an honest to goodness heart scale. Let me guess. You want me to teach you one of uh, you want me to teach one of your Pokemon's a move? Which Pokemon needs tutoring? Okay. Um. Out of curiosity, what can Jirachi? Sorry, th there isn't any move I could teach that Pokemon. What? You're a fake. You're a phony. I hate you. Uh, I guess my Torterra. Whoa, Woodhammer this early? It's not bad. Mega Drain, Bite, Curse, Leafage, Razor Leaf, Absorb, Withdraw. Um. No. Yeah, no. Sorry. What about, um, Vespa Queen? Maybe I leveled up too early. Or, I don't fucking know. When did she get attack order and defense order? No? Okay, I guess that's something I just have to get to. Attack order and defense order. Okay, struggling bug. Or struggle bug. Bug bite. Gus, poison sing, confused ray, fury cutter, Arom Ar aromatic miss, fell stinger, when a user knocks out a target with this move. Well, yeah, fell stinger is actually kind of nice. Nah. Okay, one more. What about, um. What about. Luxray? I guess. Electric terrain. Tackle, Leer, Thundershock, Charge, Roar. Electric terrain would be neat. I don't know. This is a lot of thinking. And the water looks nice. Have you been to the Pokemon Mansion? The owner, Mr. Backlot, likes to brag about his rare Pokemon. Um... Okay. It is still kind of late, so I am curious. Where is it? Uh, where, where? Flamora. Fuck, wrong town. That's not the town I wanted. This, whatever. I'm already here. Come on, baby Hippini. You're so slow. Oh my god. Is the Drifloom here? No. Of course not. Oh fuck. Wild encounter. Okay, whatever. Ah. Oh, boys. There's no goddamn way you survive this. If you survive my weakest attack, uh, nope, you're not surviving this, but if you do, I'll catch you. Nope. Sorry, buddy. Too weak. Alright, let's go. Go, 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 go. Yeah, no wild encounter. Let's go. Thank you, Wild Bidoof, wherever you came from. Go, oh my god, go. Nice. Okay, go, 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 go. Bet. Okay. Well, it's still night. Come on, are you? 
Come on, come on, come on. There's probably a hidden item. Yep, there's an item on the right. I saw that. Come on, come on. No, the TV's upstairs. Fuck. Come on, come on, come on. Is it this one? So, oh, the one on the left. Fuck, fuck, fuck. Hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. I want the Rotom. The TV has an oddly well, I'm not, malevolent feel. It's as if it's as if it is staring. Oh, so I guess uh, here. Uh, fuck! I have to look it up real quick. How to get the Rotom? Whoa, ghastly! It's so scary. Go this with Queen Murder. How to get Rotom. Okay, uh, well first. Well, I didn't mean to run away, but whatever. How to get Rotom. Uh, oh fuck. Okay. It's weird. It said inspect the TV between 8 p.m. and 4 a.m. since Rotom won't appear during the day. Yeah, but like, it's still pretty early. Whatever, I'll do it like another day. See if, uh,. Dreadplay. Oh fuck, I didn't read the thing. I'm so sorry. Fuck, that one actually had lore. I'm so sorry, I just pressed A. Ah, oh, I feel like an asshole. Hopefully, um, shit. Whatever, I'm sorry. Here, I'll, um, I'll Google what the, what the Dreadplay says. That way, I can redeem myself at least. I'm also trying to figure out why Rotom isn't appearing. Let's see. It says check it during like night, but it is still night, right? What? It says I need the national decks? Is this true? People are saying that I need the national decks in order to get Rotom. But I don't remember that. Maybe I'm wrong, I'm sorry. Oh well, let's uh... While we're still here, let's quickly Google what the Dreadblade said. Alright, just murder. What does it say? This okay, great. Uh, fuck. What does it say? Well, I'm sorry, I shouldn't be standing still. Ah. I heard laughing. It's crazy, I genuinely heard laughing. Is it this picture? There it is. What the hell? Oh, 
Ja. I have the queen of bees on my side. What are you gonna do to me, ghost? Oh, okay, I think I found what it said. Um, the dread plate. Two makes matter, and three makes spirit shaping the world. Okay. Yeah. I think that's what it said. Two makes matter. Uh, and then let's just repeat it. So, two makes matter, and three makes spirit shaping the world. So... Maybe is representing Diaga and Pokia. Diaga's space, Pokia's time. And then when you include Giratina, which is... Um, I forgot what Giratina represents. It's like... I forgot. But it's like maybe like antimatter or some shit. Maybe, I don't know. But this is cool because they're like... They're... Try... Something. There is all three of them that's required in order to keep this world flowing. It's amazing that there's like so many Pokemon out there that just like keep the world stable and then Arceus allows like a portion of their power to help you in your journey. Because it really is just a portion of their power. If you had full control of them, this world would be fucked. And that's not okay. Arceus knows what he's doing. He's just allowing you to have fun. Pokemon Magazines, Pokemon Pal, Pokemon Handbook, Adorable Pokemon. Okay. I'm explore the top floors. And then apparently, what it's telling me is that I can't get Rotom until the national deck, so it doesn't even matter. Let's just go here and get out of here. Oh, wait, I know what to do. There's this item I got earlier. Let's see, dread play cleanse tag, there it is. An item to be held by a Pokemon. It helps keep wild Pokemon away if the holder is the head of the party. Yeah. It's pretty cool. And I got it in the Pokemon graveyard shit in the tower. So um fucking warding off evil spirits with my cleanse tag. Nice antidote. Fridge. Plates. Hopefully I get nothing. What? I still get an encounter. You are one evil, evil spirit. We gotta, we gotta get out of here, make some progress. I just wanted to see if I could get Rotom, but nope. Can I even escape Rope? I don't want a trainer card, but uh, we are badge, I guess. Holy crap, them shits are fucking dirty as hell. I gotta polish the shit out of them. Dawn. That's well, pretty cool. Look at her Ultra Ball backpack. Ultra Ball. Yeah. Alright, uh, so fucking. Let's continue. This app attacks. It appears as if it is glancing. Okay, let's get out of here. Maybe it really is morning. Almost too late to get the road time. But it doesn't matter. I mean, I got plenty of Rotoms in my Pokemon um, home, so it's all good. Rotom's not that hard to get. Yeah, it's definitely morning. Holy crap. 
Alright, uh... Oh fuck, this is stupid. <laughs> okay. Um... Yeah, you should have the Hearthstone, in all honesty. Yeah. It's weird, but it's funny, because, um... You have that move. Although a Silver Powder would also be really good. I need you to have... The Amulet Coin. Because you'll be lead. And I would like to make some money. Um, I caught a rare Pokemon in Pistoria's Great Marsh. You definitely have to go. I recommend it without hesitation. Okay. Pistoria's City. Get the fucking berry, oh my god. Oh, a peony is holding something. A shook a berry. Thank you, baby, a peony. Apini is surveying the area. Apini is our scout. Alright. Thank you, Wild Badoof. Very helpful. Okay, I guess, uh... Oh... Makes sense. Thank you, Wild Badu. Special attack. Oh, it's a nerd. Dodge nerd. I just want to survey the area before I fight anyone. Ooh. That was close. Alright, I guess I should take out the nerd. Oh, here comes a nice trainer. This is worth evaluation. Scientist Sean and Abra. My dude, you need to eat. Look at you, you're bony. Who am I to judge? I'm kind of skinny too. Man, I'm not skinny skinny, but that could be better. <laughs> I gotta be in shape. So, uh, hopefully, you're not floating. Let's hit you with an earthquake. Nice. In this situation, Solar Beam is not okay. Well, thanks, considering. Yeah, again, I need you to do another earthquake. Nice. Just murdered that fucking Kadabra. Abracadabra magic. Ah, our research arrived at this one conclusion. You're tough. Well, thanks. Now give me your money. A huge variety of Pokemon live in the Great Marsh. You see, countless years ago, this whole area was under the sea. And that's super cool. I'm imagining that. Look at the trees. They're growing. And then apparently this whole area was underneath the ocean. When it rains, I get happy. Well, that's nice. Maybe your senior pink's wife, Sabrina. Why is it your name Russia? My awesome Torterra. I know, I know, Solar Cream is, is super. You know what? Fuck it. Let's see how long it takes. Okay, turn one. Wasted turn. Absorb that light. 
fireballs. Might get the confusion. Turn 2, Solar Beam. But not as strong, I think. Still super effective. 120 damage, 2 turns. But not as strong, considering rain. Eh, it's not that bad. It's not very easy trying to battle while holding an umbrella. Then put the fucking umbrella down! It's as simple as that. I don't want to get wet. Shut up. It is rain. If it rained every day, I could have my umbrella open all the time. There are Pokemon that become more powerful when it rains. That's true. Swift Swim. Uh, water type po uh, water type Pokemon increases their water type moves. Yeah, that's a lot of good shit. I wonder if Water Pulse uh, increases. Not is Water Pulse the one that heals you, or is it the one that confuses you? I forgot. Sorry, now you forgot. <laughs> I think Water Pulse is the attack. No, I don't remember. Alexa is gonna send out a Weasel. Uh, I think the Earthquake would kill. Ooh, nice. Dodged it. Always remember that the more your Pokemon love you, the more they'll do better for you. It's true. It may make sense. If our situations were reversed, I'd give my life for my Pokemon. When I lose, my tears fall like rain. They call me Rain Woman. Okay. That sounds stupid. And then she, she becomes Rain Woman. <laughs> I want to show off my pretty parasol, but it will get dirty in the rain. Oh, such a big dilemma. It's really stupid. Okay, it's like you can't ride bikes in the mud. Trainer tips. If you get stuck in the bog, you can count on being there for a while. There's no need to panic. Just struggle and keep trying to move around for a bit. Bicycles cannot be ridden on marshy ground, incidentally. Shards wanted. Tentacle machines offered. My big sister collects shards. She says they remind her of the uh, of the place she worked a long time. If you find ten shards of the same color, please let me know. I would gladly trade you a tentacle machine for them. Okay, I guess I don't have shards. Sunny dance, rain dance, sandstorm, and hail. The weather institute. Let's go to the park. Boggy area. Bug wild encounter. A bi barrel. Go for it, Torterra. Uh, I shouldn't run because experience, experience. Oh shit, I fell. Ah, why do I keep on falling? Toxic. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Uh, is it... Whoops. That was like a jump scare. <laughs> I dropped my controller. Sorry. Can you keep up with us? Ranger Tyler or Taylor. Luxio. Nice. 
Express. Alright, a weasel. No, earthquake shall do. Got energy to burn. However hard you battle, make sure you never harm the environment. Try not to break any branches or trample over plant or trample any plants, okay? Yeah, for real. Am I stuck in the bog? Of course not. How silly. This is a full body mud pack. If it weren't, I would be squirming and struggling to get out. Oh shit. Get me out of this fucking mud! Ah. Stop, poor Don. Can't you see I'm fishing? Don't talk, you'll startle the fish. Fisher Juan. Fisher Juan sent out Gyarados. Luxray, get rid of this Gyarados! <laughs> nice. Oh, and you got a crit! Thank you, because I did a dramatic pose. <laughs> and like, there's obviously no camera, but it's really retarded because I did a dramatic pose. <laughs> Luxray, get rid of this Gyarados! <laughs> I'm not sure if you heard the snap. It was really funny. Thank you, Luxray. Sheesh! I let a Pokemon end that and that battle get away from me. Fishing and battling are delicate things, as I am as am I. Is that wrong? <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> Water Pokemon sure get happy when it rains. So do I. Fisher Travis. Barboach. I love that Pokemon. That's so cute. Alright, um, sorry buddy. Even though you're like legit one of my favorite Pokemon, you're gonna die. Yeah, it's definitely morning. Even if I did have the National Dex, there's probably a good chance I wouldn't have got that road song. Ah, oh, fuck, why'd you confuse me, buddy? Torterra, land it! Don't die! Hey, thank you. Oh my god, <laughs> that looks painful. <laughs> nice. Another one. Okay. It is ground type, so even if you wanted to use electricity, it's not a good idea. Oh shit, you snapped out of the confusion that quickly. And you're confused again. I'm not surprised. Hit yourself. You know what? I demand you hit yourself. Okay, never mind. <laughs>
Alright. Shell us. Okay. Shell us is water, so it's all good. You could spark it up. Nice. Alright, baby penny level thirty. Barboach. Uh I don't want to send out freaking fucking barboach. Okay, whatever. I trust you, Luxury. Nice. That was really good. Fisher Travis. Oof, just got trampled right under your feet that time. What? This guy is scary. Yep, a kid like you should be running around outside, rain or shine. I wish some fishing loving lady come along, but no, it's all just trainers. I don't blame you. A Goldeen. Oh, Cameron. Fisher Cameron. Why are you worried about my fat? I saw that, Torterra. Why are you worried? Why are you judging me about my clothes? So what if Dawn is showing... Okay, I agree. Dawn is showing a bit too much leg. I wish she was wearing socks or something. <laughs> That's just me. Yo, fuck you. Fuck you, Torterra. Even though I agree with you, fuck you. How dare you judge me? <laughs> Alright, nice. Sure, so I lost, but I'll keep on fishing. Poor Fisher Cameron. If you know any, if you know of any ladies who like fishing, help me reel one in. All right, guys, we gotta. All right, we gotta, we gotta help our homie Fisher Cameron get some bitches. <laughs> that should be like a side. That should be like a side quest, some, like some fucking elaborate side quest. Oh, sorry, I mean to press the whole menu. <laughs> I'm using one of them controllers that has the, um, the plus in the menu thing, like, super close. Sorry. So you saw, like, my menu for a split sec. I wonder what games I had. I know it was, like, Tori 3D. Tori 3D is really good. I like Tori. Um, what else? If I can remember. Maybe the Pac-Man Museum. Uh, Mario Party, because like I said, we've been playing a lot of Mario Party. <laughs> I find it reassuring to be on this damn soil. And you're probably, if you notice the time for a split second, you're like, oh damn, it's early. But yeah, it's early. No, I'm just chilling. You know? Any important shit I gotta do like in the afternoon, so I'm just chilling. Cadaver. You know, it is gamer's game. It's fucking gay as hell. <laughs> so whatever. Alright, let's, uh, where do you wait real quick? Oof, oof, oof. You just had to beat me. Alright. Let's see. It feels good to mope here after a loss. Oof, oof, oof. It's 
raining. Oh my god, it's fucking raining. Wait, it's a wild encounter. I know I said I should fight them. They're like super low level. Oh my fucking god, again? It's the same one. You thought you could escape? Fuck! The fuck is this shit? Okay. Resilia. I'll tell you what. You survived this solar beam. I might catch you. Actually, you will. You will survive. It's fucking times four resistant. Whoops. Shit. Seems kind of not fair. How about we make it spicy? You survive a solar beam. Oh, okay. Uh, I was about to say, you could do that, by all means. You survive a solar beam with my special attack increase. Let's see what you got. Moment of truth. <laughs> oh shit. I don't know, honestly, I'm surprised. I don't have that many Pokeballs to be honest. Nice. I don't know why I caught it, but uh, it's whatever. Resilia's data will be added to the Pokedex. The thorn Pokemon. The beautiful flowers on its arm have toxic thorns. Don't even think about picking those flowers. Always doing a dance. Hmm. You prefer actual defense over special defense. Interesting. You're not bad. Not bad at all. No, not save. I don't know how to check the box. Alright, Roselia. Hoot hoot. Routes. Oh yeah, the mail routes. I totally forgot the fucking mail routes. Yeah, that's a good one. Uh, I should keep the good ones here. I guess maybe I could mix it up. I don't fucking know. I don't really see myself mixing up. Baby Hapini, oh my god, when are you gonna fucking level up, baby Hapini? You're a lost cause. In all honesty, yeah, you are a lost cause. Why are you here? Fuck you, baby Hapini, I hate you. <laughs> Alright, now you don't want to walk with me? Oh, it is because I put you. Okay, uh, the Rangers. Oh, wait, oh, fuck, my deadly combo. Oops. By barrel.
Are you doing your part to protect the environment? I am. Our job is to protect the natural environment of this region. Ranger Jeffrey and Ranger uh, Allison. Vespa Queen, quit joking. <laughs> Holy crap, a critical on Apon. Oh my god, Vespa Queen, no! Vespa Queen used Power Gem on the trainer. The trainer lost his left arm. The trainer can no longer hold the shield. <laughs> I've been playing too much for your hunger. Alright, um. Solar beam. You know what? Bug buzz, what's the buzz? Oh shit. It's a fairy type. Fuck you, baby Apini. Get out of here. Wait, you had two fucking print clubs. How the fuck did you get two print clubs? I mean, who am I to judge on? actual human being that plays Pokemon Go and gets so many starters, but still, you're an NPC. <laughs> okay, uh, Poison Jab is exactly what I wanted. Venoshock is not a, uh, well, it's pretty good, but it's not that good for, um, Krogunk. Unless you have, what's it called? It's, uh, Work Up. In this situation, I wouldn't, like, Yes, so I get it, it doubles. It's, it's not you're not a special attack for your physical attack. Nice. Go ahead, baby Hapini. I guess this is your kill. You can scramble their brains. <laughs> they both look innocent smiling. Baby Apini legit fucking scrambled your brains. Good, you seem to be a kind hearted trainer. We have to get tougher than this. People, Pokemon, all of us, we're all a part of nature. I love how natural it is here. I wish I could live out here. We did it. Uh, the items in the back can be reorganized by pressing the X button and sorting them in various orders. An elixir. So we did it. Uh, no item. Pokemon Mansion for Pokemon V. -Way. Yeah, Torterra is lead. It's just that um, he ran out of PP. 
You got no PP energy left. Oh fuck, I dropped my phone. <laughs> Alright, put it back in the bag. I need you to be our leader. Alright, and then you can have your quick claw back. Who's lead though? Yeah, you're lead, okay. The owner of Amidity Square also owns the Pokemon Mansion. Wow. You guys rich though. Now I can get a doubles battle here. Which I I look you want. Give me the doubles battle. I want the double. Yes. Okay. If it pleases you, would you care for a Pokemon battle with me? I've never battled a young trainer like you before. I'm quite nervous. Okay, let's go. This is exactly what I want. I'm gonna get them both. Jeremy, uh, Gentleman Jeremy, and Madame Renee. Stood no chance. Your hand, the lingo Pokemon is impeccable. No oh dear, that wasn't anything like battling with my friends. Damn, that's a lot of money. <laughs> I was invited by the master of the Pokemon Mansion. Usually I'll have matches with members of my social club. Hi, hanging in there, trainer? So, okay, like, the cops, or the guards, they patrol at night. It's, it's weird calling them guards because I've been playing too much Fear and Hunger and I've been thinking about the fucking big ogres with the cleaver and the big penises. <laughs> so, the, the guards, they patrol at night and they will fight you. That's just the thing though at night. Patrol, patrols day and night. I'm feeling drowsy. Yawn. Yeah, these guys will fight at night, so I have to come back here. Why, hello there. It's always nice when a trainer stops and says hi to us police officers. Okay, they're police officers. Thank you. They're not guards. Thank God. They're not big scary guards with big penises and fucking cleavers. Christopher, what the fuck is that? Is that, is that a cleaver? Among the trees... Oh, fuck. I'm sorry. Among the trees that you can smear with honey, there are lucky trees and not-so-lucky trees. If you want to lower rare Pokemon, you have to find lucky trees. Uh... No, because I don't play this game a lot. This really is a gimmick thing. There are Pokemon nurseries in Celosia in town. If you leave a male and a female Pokemon of the same species, an egg may be found. And I traveled a long way to take part in these super contest shows. And we're back. We're back here. So... Since we're here, how about a quick Friday Night Funkin' match? Well, it's um, a little mi mini game. Oh fuck, I gotta sneeze. Damn, stop that sneeze forcefully. <laughs> but I really do gotta sneeze, so... I'll just go quiet and try to force it out again. Okay, I sneezed. 
I didn't want to sneeze into the microphone. That would have been rude. All right, since we're here, um, might as well do, do a super contest show. Which one? The cool one. Yeah, I'm pretty cool. Let's do master. I swear to God, if I lose to my mom again or fucking the gym leader, I'm gonna scream. Whatever, solar beam. Like, I tried. I, I, I legit fucking try when I'm doing this shit. Uh, good luck. Uh, my everyday clothes, I guess. I swear to god, my mom's here. Why is my mom here? I'm gonna lose to Joanne. Nice. That's not a bad perception. Alright, uh, I'll go quiet and try to focus. <laughs> Yo, let's fucking go. I swear to god, if I don't win this shit, I'm gonna be so sad. I probably won't win this. Sorry, the Super Contest show was a failure because you fucking suck. Let's go! Let's fucking go! I did it! I beat my mom! <laughs> I did it. I only fucked up once. Let's fucking go. I almost got it perfect in the dance suit. Congratulations on becoming a star of the show. Please accept the coolness master ribbons reward. <coughs> I'm sorry, I had the hiccups. We look forward to your participation another time. Thanks. It's a frame. It's a frame. Oh my god. <laughs> Why is that the image? Solar beam. It was really funny if you saw it. The fucking solar beam just obliterated myself. The coolness master rank. That's coolness. That's beauty. Okay. So let's save my boy. Best friend ribbon. Coolness, Master Ribbon. Beauty, Master Ribbon. Yeah, he's pretty cool. Wow, I can actually say that, but Tartare is pretty cool. Alright, um... Next up, Vilestone. Baby Hapini needs a massage. Baby Hapini needs a massage. Baby Hapini, baby Hapini. This building over here. Yes, I would like you to massage baby Hapini. Hapini looks extremely contented. 
party sticker. Hachichi. What do you guys say? Apeni is jumping for joy. Come on, baby Apeni. Let's see. Uh, let's see. Yeah, like, why? Why is it so short? Overalls. The Pikachu hoodie. Yeah, sure. Eevee. Wait, where's Eevee? Oh yeah, it's in the back. Hey, Tom. Gengar. Cyber is too short. Like, holy crap. What the fuck? Showing too much leg? Winter is too much stress. Spring. Not that bad, I just wish the socks were higher or some shit. And then the leather is not bad at all. But really pricey. Oh, look at that! Look at Don's hair! It's a ponytail now. Uh, yeah, I actually kind of like this one. And then there's a Pikachu. It's funny, this is because since we're chibi, our, our arms are like looking white out. It looks like we're fat fucks. Yeah, I think I'll just stick with this version. Don't wait. What are my choices? Can I not change? Casual, everyday, or Pikachu? <laughs> See, I wish. The casual, I wish you could customize it, like, I want casual style, I want, like, everything upper, like, the entire upper shit, like, she's not even wearing pants, what is she wearing? That's her shirt, what, what? Like, I want the pants of the Pikachu hoodie, and put it, maybe the shoes as well, the shoes are kind of nice, uh, yeah, actually, the shoes and the pants, on the casual style and keep the upper half and I think that'd be great the fucking casual style is showing too much leg yeah, I don't know, it's, it's just me I'm, I'm a dude, but like ah, <laughs> I guess my ideal girl is a good Christian girl <laughs> so Let's see, is everyone healed? Everyone is healed. I am near the department store, so I might as well stock up. Alright, uh, let's buy some hellish shit, man. I don't know what to buy, but we'll buy something. So, Super Podion, Cyber Podion, Max Podion, Revive, it's about time. Sadly, yes, it is about time to worry about reviving people. Tiny mushroom. Uh, nope. I don't know. Let's see. I do need Pokeballs. And then it's no longer about Pokeballs, it's about Great Balls. Alright, 30 great balls should do. Repel, max repel. Super repels. Ultra balls. Nice. 
Uh, no, actually, I'll save my Arizona money. No well, thanks. Let's get out of here. Alpini is relaxing comfortably. Fuck, uh, Alpini is trembling. Why are you trembling? Why are you scared? Why are you scared, Alpini? Thank you, random star raptor. This guy's a bomb. Gur, this is so annoying. What is it? Oh, some kid with only three gem badges that are twerps like you should know to stay out of Team Galactic's way. Now, this package from Vilestone, where should I set it off? Yep, this is going to be a smashing job for Team Galactic. Wow, well, thanks for telling me you legit have a bomb. Observatory gate. Astoria City's Great Marsh. Tell me, I'm not imagining this. The Great Marsh's Pokemon seem to be different from the ones yesterday. There are shuttle trains in the marsh called Quick Trams. You should take those if you're going to a deeper area in the marsh. Use a pair of binoculars to look out over the Great Marsh. You can see what kinds of Pokemon can be caught and where they are. When you're walking on the bog, you sometimes sink right in and I get so flustered trying to get out. I have no luck catching anything. It's a pair of binoculars. Put a hundred Pokemon coins in. Yeah, sure. Uh, Azuriel. Psyduck. Azuriel. Bidoof. Bidoof. I guess that's it. Yeah, sure. I'll use this one next. Bidoof. Starly. Psyduck. Uh, Golduck. Wow. Uh, Bidoof. Then finally I'll use the last one. Uh... Meryl Krogonk Wooper Badoof and Badoo. Okay. Let's uh what the fuck? I'm like get me out of here. <laughs> Welcome to the Great Marsh, the home of the Story of Safari game. All you can catch just for for just 500 coins, would you like to play a safari game? Yes, yes I would. Safari balls, dirty safari balls, let me know, Nick. Uh, until then, enjoy yourself, please, off you go on your wild ex- Maybe I should do a safari team. I think that'd be neat. I found these during the safari game. Each of the TM contained defog, but none of them contained- none of the, uh, no, But none of my Pokemon can learn that move. You'd be doing me a favor if you took these. Yeah, you need to come here. So it's always a good idea. It'd be good if we could set up a science or marker for a safari game. Quick, quick, out in the sticks to and fro we go. We're quick. If you're thinking about going deep into the marsh, I'd recommend you take the Great Marsh Quick Trams. I guess area four. I like to cross that. Area 3. Oh my god, a bike barrel. Guess I'll bait it out. I did it! While its movement's out of the 
uh, out of water or sluggish. It can swim as fast as many, as any fee bass. The calm by Barrow. Alright. Azuria. Oh, I ran away. Oh well. Alright, uh, let's see. Can I use my fishing rod? Yeah. Ooh, barboach. No. Why, barboach? I love you. No, I don't want to use the underground thing. Not even a nibble. Let's just keep going. A jar of honey. Throwing food at Pokemon makes it easier to catch them, but while eating it, they are likely to pull. Throwing mud at a Pokemon makes it harder to catch, but it's also get angry and become less likely to pull. Ugh, let's do. Meryl. Oh shit. Nice. Meryl. The tip of its tail is filled with oil that is lighter than water, so it acts as a float. Uh, okay. The naughty Meryl. fishing rod here, see if we can find anything. Not even a nipple. Alright, just keep exploring. A whooper! Nice. Thank you, Uber. The waterfish Pokemon. When the temperature cools in the evening, they emerge from from water to seek food along the shore. Oh, I forgot to see his stats. Oops. Oh, that's neat. Did you see in the left corner it shows the ball count? The gentle whooper. If you see in the left corner, yeah, it says the ball count. Oh, and then instead of save, it's quit. So you could just quit the game out, right? Uh, the safari game, not the actual game. Alright, another whooper, so let's just run. Okay. Another whooper! 
I'm still gonna run away. Alright, antidote. Let's see. Am I back in the beginning? Yeah, I'm back in the beginning. I guess, uh... Area 4 again. Not even in that. A pipe barrel. When you're walking on boggy parts, sometimes you get sucked down. Getting free of the bog takes time, which is a luxury in a safari game. Uh-oh, the Badoo Flood. Also, I forgot to mention, but the, the battle area of the, the Great Marsh is super nice. Look at this area, it's super beautiful. You don't even, you don't even fight people in this area, you just fucking catch Pokemon. It's so nice. Just, there's so many battle areas that you don't see that often, but like, they're super good. And this is one of many. Uh, another river of Earth ca trying to catch. Super Podion. Water. Damn, not even a fucking nibble. Paralysis heal. There's a whole upper half that I failed to go to. How do I get there? Another whooper. Oh my god, Quagsire. That was close though. If I use bait, I think I'll run away. Maybe not, but it doesn't even matter. I'm probably not gonna use this quick guy ever. See, it even acknowledged it. 
I was contemplating whether you're gonna fucking run away or just consider wasting my time. Quagsire's Zeta data will be added. Waterfish Pokemon, a dim bodied Pokemon. It doesn't care if it bumps its head into boats or rocks while swimming. Uh, that's just me. Quagsire. The gentle Quagsire. Sun to box. Yeah, I can't get up there. A whooper. I think I am done with this area. Well, not really, because I still have an upper area to get to. It's just, I don't know how to. Yep, ding ding. Oh, ding dong, time's up. Your safari game is over. Which is fine by me, because I don't know how to get to the upper area, and there wasn't that many good Pokemon. All I needed to get was the fog, which we got. We just heal. Alright, your lead is good. Pistorius City Pokemon Gym Leader, Crasher Woik, the Torrental Mass Master. Gym Leader Wake, uh, I mean Crasher Wake, is a master of water type Pokemon. I'd say you've got guts if you try to face down water type with fire or ground type Pokemon, but that's part. Of the, but that part I'll leave up to you. Go and have some good battles. Crasher Wake Certified Trainer Barry. Yeah, that's right, our boy Barry. My body isn't the only thing I work on toughening up here. I also work on my Pokemon and my spirit. Tuber Jackie. Weasel. Alright, uh, you're still overpowered, so you don't have to you don't even have to try to spark it up my guy. Damn! Nice. Wow, trainer, you just might be tougher than our gym leader. Maybe I'll do like wake, I mean crash your wake and wear the same kind of mask. Oh, okay. I have mastery over the incredible power of water. You won't win. He's a waterbender. You have a Gyarados? No, a Barboach. Barboach. Rip. Oh, his name is Walter. Walter. But this kid wins anyways. I'm just bowled over. The water rising and falling is tricky, but don't let it annoy you. If you lose sight of yourself, that's when you're set to lose. Just go here. I've traveled all over the globe while raising Pokemon. This is the gym I've chosen. You'll find it a handful for sure. 
Sailor Damien. Alright, spark it up. Nice. Oh shit, baby a peony. Good job. Please, 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 for the love of God, please fucking evolve, baby a peony. You are a liability. Alright, spark it up. Nice. You, you're a kind of a, you're a kind of a top class tough. If you were to go around the world, I'm sure you'd meet tougher Pokemon. And then I think I talked to you, yeah. Next up is this girl. Yeah, we're still good. Why am I even checking? I want to become a strong trainer like Crash or Wake. Azurio, Caitlyn. Tuber Caitlyn sends out Azurio. Alright. Uh, whoops, I didn't mean that. Okay. But that's overkill, sorry. <laughs> Alright, time to spark it up. Ground, you're too much. Maybe I'll do like Wake, I mean Crash or Wake, and use the same kind of Pokemon. I've landed the most fish Pokemon in the world. I'm next. Fisher Eric. A Goldeen. Alright, just spark it up again. Nice. Barboach. You got that fucking barboach energy. I walk it every everywhere I go I got that barboach energy. Gyarados, oh my god. You know, I don't know why, but in my mind I was thinking that every time you play Pokemon, you have your Pokemon, and then you go through your journey, you have a great time, and then they're just there in the boxes forever. Pokemon should make a game where all the Pokemon that you have it would be like that shitty. Well, it wasn't that bad. But being number one in the world doesn't mean a thing. That's true. It really doesn't. But like I was saying, um, I figure I got too wrapped up in fishing and neglected training. But, uh, like I was saying, so Pokemon should make a game where all your Pokemon are available and to like have and just attack. And then you can see the history of you and your Pokemon. Is it would be like that Final Fantasy game where I think it's called the Bravest or whatever, where you gotta pay money. <laughs> it's really shitty, but like uh, I don't know. 
uh, like the raging sea, I crash down and wash away everything before me. That's just how I roll. But like I was saying, huh? You wouldn't pay money when my vision is just that out. Oh, your Pokemon. You would have to pay money there, but you wanted, like, the full access for the Pokemon alone. But it's like all your Pokemon. It should be a little game in the Pokemon. All your Pokemon just chill. And then do many games and stuff. Get you the special currency. The BP battle points to get the special items. Yeah, I think that'd be nice. That way your Pokemon have something to do. And they're not just there in the boxes. Because they really are just there. Hell, oh, Luxray, Resto Queen, Miss Dravis, Girl Gong, Torterra, Hapini. They're all going to the box eventually. This journey will last forever. And it'd be cool if they could have something to do. Shell loss. All right, we did it. Trainer or Sailor Samson? That wave didn't even have. That wave didn't even wash my hands. I'm now becalmed like a waveless sea. And we did it. We made it to Crusher Wake. It's him. Okay, uh... This is fine. Welcome. I don't get challenged very often. Uh, how should I read it? What voice should I do? Heavy? Or... I don't, I don't know. Oh, oh, I'll just read normally. Uh, the glory day. The glory you are now beholding is the Pastoria gym leader. That's right, I'm Crash Awake. My Pokemon were toughened up by stormy white waters. They'll take everything you can, throw at them, and then pull you under. Victory will be ours. Come on, let's get it done. I don't know what voice was that. I was trying to do like Hulk Hogan or some shit. Oh, man, he's savage. He's, he's a wrestler, I guess. Gyarados, easy kill. Get hype, looks right. Fighting a gym leader. Oh fuck yeah! You look back at me, I look at you. You nodded together. Looks right. Get rid of this Gyarados. Good job. Oh my god, you landed a crit as well? Guess what, Luxury? I did a dramatic pose and snapped again. <laughs> Good job, Luxury. So proud of you. Payback? Ew, no, it's a physical attack. Ghost. Waxire. This is the part where you tag out your bro. Might has Ice Fang or some shit. Oh, he's trying to lower my accuracy, asshole. Fuck you. Might miss. Oh wait, no, my speed? Perfect. I don't give a shit about my speed. Take my speed. Now you die times four! Rip. Synthesis. Photosynthesis. Photosynthesis. Uh, no, I'm good. Load soul. Yeah. 
job, Torterra. Oh, luxury, I know you can do it. You for real can do this. Hey, that there, that was a good move. Go ahead, buddy. End it. Brian. Hero Brian. Rip. Did you get a crit? No, but it's all good. You did it. Alright. Baby Apeny. Please, for the love of God, love up. I mean, fucking evolve. Wow, it's gone and ended. How will I say this? I want more. I wanted to battle a lot more. And use your actual Pokemon. Don't use a level requirement Pokemon. It seems the Undertale pulled me under, but I had a great time battling with you. You've earned this. Nice. You received the Fen Badge from Wake. Need that fen badge to use the hidden machine, hidden move default from your Pokatch. These are a special reward from me in recognition of your team's power. Uh, stickers. And that's probably Brian. Yep. Those TM55s each contain the move Brian and inflicts double damage on targets with less than half their HP left. Use it to the end battles. Use it to end battles decisively. The styles of battling and winning are as widely varied as trainers are. Do you want to know how I battle? I battle so I can. Uh, I battle so I can say I had fun at the end, whether I win or lose. Yeah, true. Okay, so I got the gym badge. I'm just gonna save and end it here. It could go longer, but. Uh, it's already kind of early in the morning. Oh, Brian, you being the gym leader? So how was it? Did you enjoy your battle against Wake? I mean, Crash or Wake? Sure, winning is important, but don't forget to have fun, too. I think Wake, I mean, Crash or Wake showed you what I mean by fun. Yeah, it's true. Crash or Wake, Barry and Brian. We're the BB brothers, Barry and Brian. Okay, good. The terrorist hasn't acted as polite yet, but if I go more that way, the terrorist will. The terrorist will win. So it's better if I just save. Alright, uh, next, next time. Alright, yeah, we did it. So, I guess, yeah, you should keep the amulet coin. You're really good. I'm gonna see my team. I noticed... I don't have a sooth bell. I guess the metronome wouldn't be that bad. Maybe Hapini really does need to fucking fight more. Yeah, you should be number two, just in case. And Torterra. I don't fucking know what I'm doing. But yeah, that's a good team. The baby Hapini. Luxray. Vespaclean. Krogonk. And it's funny, I haven't even used Krogonk. Like, at all. Now that I think about it. But I know Krogunk's really good. Holy crap, insanely good. <laughs> Restores HP and water, reduces HP and summer sunlight, and increases the damage with super fair. Um Okay, so it really is, depends on where you are. You are perfect with a water type. Yeah. Okay, you and you would be perfect for water, Krogunk, and Luxray. And then it would hinder you with your solar beam. I don't know, there's a lot of thinking. Think, think, think. Pokemon. I love Pokemon. 
any TMs worth teaching? Brian, D5, Sunny Day, Toxic, Substitute, and Focus Punch. Ariel is Trick Room. No? That's really about it. Alright, uh, yeah. In all honesty, I don't really feel like I don't really feel like exploring the underground right now. I mean, maybe I might just off screen just a little bit, but uh, it's not really okay. Let's you know what? Let's check together, just in case to see where we are. Yeah, play it long because there's different sections. I want to see which section we ended up in. Got hiccups. Okay, I'm here. I explored it fully. Oh shit! Um, the one on the left corner, I, I didn't explore. Hmm. Should I go through? I mean, I could just go quiet. Hard. Shit, maybe I, uh... Okay, episode's not over, actually. Sorry about that. Let's go back home. See if I land in the right area. Hello, mother. It's very nice seeing you. Mama Joanne. It's very beautiful. And then, fucking, let's go to the underground. I lost so many times to fucking mother Joanne. Ah, oh, you don't know, uh, like, if you lost the episode, I lost like, two or three times. Maybe four. To fucking Joanne. Mommy Joanne. <laughs> she is hot. What's it called? Let's go. Yeah, a lot of the designs for the mature women in Pokemon. Pretty, pretty women. What's it called? None of them are real. And no woman has colored hair or has just like a skinny body. Most women are round. <laughs> and that's just the honest truth. Ooh, I love you. I want you. Chingling. Okay, uh, I'll just go quiet, explore the underground, and if there's something to read, I'll read. Something to say, I'll say. So I'll just go quiet right now. Hopefully, I don't kill this Chingling. <laughs> I wanted to fucking copycat the entertainment shit. I honestly thought that was a good one. That was your bad idea. So let's just continue exploring. Holy shit. More Pokemon are coming out. Ooh, Magneton! Love Magneton. Alright, I'm gonna go quiet again. Let's get this Magneton. 
Whoops, sorry, Magnet Might. <laughs> I'm a dummy. I think Magneton is the second form, and then Magnezone is the third form. I love Magnet Might. Wow, 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 wow. My fucking Luxury was too strong and murdered the Magnemite with Spark. I just, I didn't want Baby Hapini to die. Because then Baby Hapini would fucking, um, what's it called? Not want to level up anytime soon. Or not level up. Fucking evolve. You Baby Hapini. Needs friendship. Fuck Baby Hapini. I hate it. It's a girl, right? Yeah, you're a girl. I hate you. Fuck you. God, fucking I hate friendship Pokemon. It's always the same shit with friendship Pokemon. Friendship Pokemon always takes a fucking long time. And they say friendship Pokemon are like one of the best, but like I agree, like some friendship Pokemon are insanely good. And you know, that's how it should be. Like you you should like you should have a team that you trust. Baby Opini, I trust you, but I need you to put in work. <laughs> Okay, there's a Veneri, and uh, I'm gonna go quiet again, just keep on exploring. Dude, look at that, a gold bat. Uh, if I don't kill it, I might catch it. So let's see. Yeah, it stood no chance. <laughs> I'm sorry, Goldbat, I murdered you. It stood no chance whatsoever. It's really funny just appearing behind a pincer. But, uh, yeah, hopefully I can catch it this time. Wait, I think I actually do have a pincer. Uh, maybe I forgot. Let's see if there's a Pokeball symbol next to this. Yeah, there is. Okay, I have a pincer in the box. I forgot about it. But, yeah, um, let's see if I can catch this one again.
Okay. Uh, Michelle. Hello. I'm Michelle. Try giving spheres to the folks standing around the underground. They might trade you something nice. You may even find some. Uh, you may find. You may even find someone that'll heal your Pokemon for you. That's true. Hello. I'm Michelle. Okay. Thank you, Michelle, for giving me the tips of the underground. Oh shit, look at that, another female. I got a female combi. Wait, I gotta show it. I wonder. Maybe. Maybe the female combi will join us after seeing the mighty Vespa Queen. What do you think? Care to join after seeing your queen? Let's see. One, two, three. 
Oh my god, I did. I called it. I fucking called it. The the female combi saw the mighty Vespa Queen and immediately joined. That was wholesome. Quiet. Uh, not bad. Honestly, not bad. It's into a box. Yeah, that's pretty good. <laughs> Hello, I'm Leticia. What I'd give to find a gorgeous stone box. Hello, I am Leticia. Hopefully I said her name, right? Uh, okay, let's continue exploring. Going quiet. It's it's weird. Um, <laughs> Apom used to be rare, but then like playing Arceus, it's funny because you see so many Apoms in Arceus. But yeah, it's it's rare seeing an Apom here, and I do want to catch you. So, uh, yeah. I need your help, Miss Travis. I really do like a Palm Apon's call. Um Dazzling Lane. Please. Shit. You know fuck baby Apini. Baby Apini doesn't evolve anytime soon. I want Apom on my team. Yeah, I don't want to risk it, so... Do you like normal Pokeball, I guess? Um, yeah, I don't blame you for getting out. I don't want you to kill the Apom. Three. Oh my god. Yay! I got the A-Palm. I'm, I'm genuinely happy I got an a -palm. It's funny because like, my, I shouldn't be this happy because I know in my Pokemon home I have like so many fucking A-Palms. Look at it do a dance! Oh my god. Look at that. I fucking love A-Palm. Ah, fart. I love Apom so much. Long tail Pokemon. It lives atop giant trees. It wraps its tail around a branch so it won't fall off while asleep. Alright. Apom, the careful. Ooh, nice. That's really good because Apom is not a special attacker. So thank you, Apom. Yeah, I definitely want you on my team. Let's see the the dream team. 
the the off screen. Okay, you're not dream team status, but like sorry. <laughs> The Swamp Blue is worth having. It's just that I know I had it on my team. It's just that I don't want Pokemon from different generations. I would rather keep it Gen 4 on my team. I know Miss Dravis is Gen 2, technically, but Miss Maggie is. Uh, yeah, everyone here is good. So just keep on going. Alright, I'm gonna go quiet and just explore more of the underground. <laughs> Hello, I'm Rika. Try giving spheres to the folks standing around the underground. They might trade you something nice. You may even find someone that'll heal your Pokemon for you. Oh, okay, I already got that information from someone else. But thank you, Rika.
Cascoon's data will be added to the Pokédex. Cascoon, the Cocoon Pokémon, in case within a tough co- if I can't even read it. In case within its tough cocoon in its- Fuck me. Fucking hate my life. <laughs> in case within its tough cocoon it endures attacks, it never forgets the appearance of its foes. Oh shit. Okay, let's read that again because I'm retarded. In case within its tough cocoon it endures attacks, it never forgets the appearance of its foes. So, always remember, you can hurt Cascoon, but Cascoon will never forget. And when Cascoon is strong, Cascoon will have its revenge. <laughs> That's awesome. Yeah, I'm definitely curious. I want to see your stats. The Rash Cascoon. Hmm. You're a special attacker, but you can't take special attacks. Weird. Alright, to the box you go. I caught a Lickitung. Oh, I already had a Lickitung. Oh wait, uh, I didn't. It's just that it's not in the Pokédex. It's National Pokédex number down. That's really good. I got a Lickitung though, um, because I want its evolution, Licky Licky, and it's not that hard to get. All you have to do is just teach it roll out and then evolve it. So yeah, this is pretty good. <laughs>
it off here. We made some really good progress today. I got the gym, I explored the marsh area, I got defog. Um, yeah, my Pokemon are up to 40. Maybe a Peony really needs to evolve or else I'm gonna have to replace her with fucking Apom. And I have no guilt over that because I love Apom so much. But yeah, okay, so that was a really good part time. <laughs> Can't wait for part 11. I love this game so much, it's just that I have a hair out shit to do, I'm sorry. If I could play video games all day, I would. <laughs> but anyways, yeah. Thank you so much for watching if you did, or if you decided to watch this part of it, if you're just clicking around, or if you happen to stumble across this video, I don't know how you're watching this or why you're watching this, but thank you so much for giving me the time of your day. And take care wherever you are in the world, and be safe. Bye, and take care. <laughs>